Hello, hello, everyone. Blitzball Champ is back, and I have for you a brand new episode of 205 Live, brought to you by Team Galgo Wrestling under Geek Out with Games Out. We are here in Houston, Texas, looking to bring forth you some great action from the best cruiserweights in the business. So, let's talk about our card Here tonight. We, go. Um, we got a whole bunch of single matches, night. and um, the Cruiserweight title will be up for grabs. It will be on the line, defended in the main event tonight. Um, our other matches, we have um, we have a tag team match. We will have Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly, Red Dragon, will be taking on Team Japan of Hideo Itami and Akira Tozawa. Um, we got Cedric Alexander going up against Arya Davari. We got Mustafa Ali going up against Noam Dar. In our main event, Drew Gulak will defend the Cruiserweight Championship against Grand Metallic. Um, but in our first match of the evening, we will have... Uh, the current number one contender, gentleman Jack Gallagher, we have singles in singles action, action against Sin Cara. Now, regardless of, of who wins the, the title match tonight, gentleman Jack Gallagher will get his title shot at TLC. So, um, just wanted to note that. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started for 205 Live. Let's go to the ring. Oh, gentleman Jack Gallagher comes out, but here comes Sin Cara. And Sin Cara is already... Uh-oh. Trying to get one up on uh, gentleman Jack Gallagher. Unlike you, Byron, Jack Gallagher can actually pull off the old school tube socks. There's a... Ooh, there's a suplex. Ooh, I don't want to know what back. that feels like. And Sin Cara is in trouble right now. Oh, and Jack Gallagher in full control. And now, finally, finally bringing it back in the ring. Running through this arena. This is going to oh, back. The shoulders are down. Dragon Suplex pin. Kicks out in the nick of time. It's a one count. Way too early. Oh, he what a the punch with great by gentleman Jack Gallagher. Oh, reversal by Sin Cotta. See if he can use his speed oh to his advantage goodness, and try to mount some offense Check out on gentleman Cara's Jack offense. Gallagher. So a far, so good. Seen Cara in a precarious situation. I fully to bounce back though. Uh -oh. This is the type of one on one. Oh, drop kick to the back. In, I wouldn't the corner. call for the medics just yet. Uh oh, but here comes. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. Turn in Jack Gallagher again, another vertical suplex. Taking too much offense up to this point, but that can obviously all change here. Uh oh, stretching out his arm. Oh, oh that's got to hurt. Why? Drop kick delivered with precision. Standing drop kick. The human body shoulders are down. Early kick out. Referee right on top of the action. Way too early. Oh. Zincara just too fast. Oh. And Gallagher says, not this time. And then Jack Gallagher in full control now. That lands. So on forearm. I don't like oh, the he's going to the top here, rope. I wonder what he'll try to do. Look at this. Oh, he went for the elbow drop. Assault. I don't know if he got all of it. But I think he got enough of it to do some major damage. 
I sure hope there's some sort of investigation going on right now behind the scenes. There's oh. no way this superstar nice. deserves to be ranked so high. Clearly, somebody's been greasing the hands of the voters. And a savage clothesline. Oh. And he finished the job. Come on, Jack Gallagher. You can do this. Northern Lights. Uh-oh, and Jack Gallagher. And Jack Gallagher is back in control. Oh, there's the headbutt. There's the this headbutt. Could be it. Hate to I think he may want the... Theory, uh, Corey, but I don't see any objection to this superstar's ranking at all, and I think most people would agree. Am I right, Byron? Corner drop oh, kick. There it is. There's that corner Jack. drop kick that, that Jimmy Jack Gallagher does so good. well. And just like that, the number one contender for the Cruiserweight Championship. Now Gentleman Jack Gallagher reaction. picks up the victory in our opening contest. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud Team to be tried to get a one up on him in the beginning. I but could watch highlights not of that enough. Just night not long. enough. One of the great WWE the matches I've kick. ever been able to watch. Which helped signify the win for gentleman Jack Gallagher. Here is your winner, gentlemen Jack so he will face the winner of tonight's Kicking main event with an impressive victory. At TLC. Well, that's the type of action we're going to get all night long. Shot. I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. Very nice, very nice. I did it. Indeed. All righty, next up. Singles action we is will up next. have You're not gonna um, miss Cedric this. Alexander going one on one, one with Arya Davari. Um, oh, we are this going should anywhere. be a should be an interesting matchup. Let's go to the ring. Here's the man who's put the cruiser away. We got Charlotte, North Carolina's own Cedric Alexander. He's a former cruiserweight champion. The soul of WWE's cruiserweight division. And it's been kind of on a losing streak in real life. The ring, hopefully, from Charlotte, North Carolina, can get his groove back. Because he was a great cruiserweight champion. He's an excellent champion. Man's got hydraulics in his legs and dynamite in his fists. Cedric Alexander oh, yeah. is fun to watch. You, know, you look at every superstar, and every superstar has their individual motivations. Well, for Cedric Alexander, it is simply to be a good role model for his young daughter to prove that as long as you put in the work, you can succeed at whatever you want to do. All right, and he's waiting for his opponent. Look who's here! Oh, yeah, Devar. And his opponent from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 195. But yeah, I wonder, wonder if he'll ever make his return. I, I figured he, he was injured, but you know, hopefully he'll actually make his return. Davari, also the younger brother of former WWE superstar Sean Davari, but Ari has done a very good job of paving his own path. All right, Cedric Alexander, Arya Davari, let's do it. This should be an incredible matchup. Oh, I mean, what a reversal. Both men have Man. extensive offensive repertoires, lasting endurance, oh. and an insatiable appetite to be number one. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys. Oh, what a reversal. Hey, Corey, when's the last time you checked your lumbar? I don't know what you're trying to get at, Saxton. I don't oh, consent to a lumbar check suplex. from Cedric Alexander. I've got my own chiropractor. Thank you very much. Oh, reverse suplex. Inverted suplex. That hurt. Oh, 
like a turn. That was like a turning Michinoku driver of some sort. Oh, and right now, Cedric Alexander is putting in work on Arya Davari. It's not looking. It's not looking good for him. Close line in the corner. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. Uh oh, set. Alexander's going. Oh, misses the elbow drop. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little Ouch. bump in the road for him here. Nothing it's to worry about. Knee to the Gets back. Him with the knee there. Goes for the pin. Yeah, Gets I don't out. believe that, that, that he didn't win this match right there. Nah, not yet. Too early. Oh, what a takedown. Oh. Avoids the step up in Zaguri. Nice reversal. Ah. Warm up the buses. This one's over. Uh oh. Cedric Alexander's in big trouble now. Arya Davari in control. How is the ref not seeing this? He's starting to stumble here. We all know, though, this guy has plenty of fight left Ooh. in him. He just has to make sure this doesn't oh, get too what a out of hand for him. Neck breaker Sometimes, from momentum Mario has a way Devari. of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. You seem more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think. He uh oh, still has is he going for a submission? Uh, uh oh, but Cedric Alexander breaks oh, out of it. Oh, his way out. a bit of a Houdini a job. Close right line. There. A kip up there. Oh yeah, here's Cedric Alexander. There's that step That's up. That's the move he was looking for. Wanted. Using every ounce of his body on that splash. Uh oh, what Cedric Alexander He's on got his in heels. mind? You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. He's really starting to look fatigued. Oh, here, guys. Cedric nice. Alexander, this might be it. I think it is. Victory is on the horizon. The night could be over for Arya Davari. Uh oh, I think Cedric Alexander, he wants that flying clothesline. Here it comes, springboard Alexander's clothesline. Bam, there it is. Cedric Alexander soaring through the sky. Now for the icing on the cake, is he gonna hit that now. lumbar check? I'd say the end is near, fellas. Just go for the finisher. Oh already. no, he gets the turning buster. brain buster instead. Capitalize on it now. Okay, twisting brain buster. Into the quick cover. And with that, twisting yes. brain buster. Unreal performance. Cedric Alexander gets the victory. Very, very impressive. Cedric Alexander reigns supreme. And the celebration tonight continues. on 205 Live. Oh, oh wait a minute. Win it all. This match is over. This is too much. Yeah, and Cedric this Alexander. This is ridiculous. What is Completely this? Uncalled for. Maybe the victory was And he's, a, oh, he's attacking they wanted to send a message. Arya Davari right afterwards. Wow. Okay. Did not see that coming. Did not see that coming at all. Wow. What has gotten in to Cedric Alexander? I just I don't Buckle I don't get because it. Because we have a contest that's going to blow the it. roof off this place. We have a team Either way, one of our next up, talents versus we have Atami. Red Dragon, Bobby Fish, Kyle O'Reilly going up against Team Japan. Of Hideo Itami and Akira Tozawa. This should be really, really good. Strong tag team match. Let's go to the ring. All right, here first is the infamous Bobby Fish. Represent the Undisputed Era. 
Introducing first, from Saratoga Springs, New York, weighing in at 197 pounds, Bobby. One half of one of my favorite tag teams ever, Red Dragon. The clock has struck fish. Somebody's about to get beat up. Bobby Fish incorporates so many styles into his offense from Bobby Boy Fish Kai, kickboxing, catch grappling, and numerous other combat arts. Fish knows so many ways to hurt his opposition. He had a proud card-carrying member of the unpredictable group known as the Man, Undisputed Era. Didn't have his You're point saying unpredictable. Too, I'm going to disagree with you, Byron. When the Undisputed Era is involved, my prediction well, at least is he got him on, got him his back tattoo. So I guess Bobby Fish I guess is that's cool. Business here tonight, as he looks to dominate this part of his WWE career. And here comes his tag team partner, Kyle O'Reilly, the violent artist. The system's about to be shocked by the Undisputed Era. And his partner from Kyle O'Reilly, submission striking specialist. Dude is the real deal. Hits hard, and he will make it tap out as well. Kyle Him and Bobby Fish for the world uh, NXT over. Tag Team Learning Champions. New ways to hurt his opponent. Proficient in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, kickboxing, and Bobby and Fish just recently returned to the arts. ring. Suffered a yeah, knee injury, I believe it was. Is, uh, in a um, I don't remember what the injury was, but it's just good to have him back. I got a feeling back. someone's about to get their lights turned out, and it's not Kyle O'Reilly. All right, first up, Hideo Itami. Superstar here in International WWE, superstar, the the very world. well known. Just really, really hoping that he can break out and, and finally win a, his first singles From title. Tokyo, Japan, you know, injuries have been now. have kind of plagued Hideo him a little bit, Tommy. but hopefully he will have a fair shot. Hideo Itami, a bona fide legend in Only Japan, Japan, one of the hardest strikers this business has ever seen. As talented as they come. Roughly translated. And I definitely will not want to get into a striking battle with this guy. And boy, Itami has lived up to that moniker. Now there are a lot of expectations. Watch out for that GTS. When it was announced that Hideo Itami was joining the roster of NXT and I'll tell you what, Hideo Tommy still carries all that weight on his shoulders. And here comes his partner, Akira Tazawa. So exciting to see the power And he was a Tazawa. former cruiserweight champion. And his partner from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds. There is an absolutely big fight feel in the arena tonight for this one. Yeah, and judging from the vibe here currently, it seems to me like this is the one this He is revved up and ready to go. Quite awesome. All right. Red Dragon, Team Japan. Let's do it. This will right, surely be a true tie up. mano a mano test. It's amazing. For more than 50 years, men and women have entered this ring all in the name and of this Bobby Fish. See you is truly the best. I think when it's all said and done, we'll be talking about this match for a long time. And it looks to me like Knee this breaker. entire arena is.
is on its feet, and understandably so. Oh, spinning kick, but catches it. That breaker. Oh, get some low kicks. Don't be fooled. Bobby Fish is quite the striker as well. Let's not be fooled. Oh, here comes Hideo. All right. Here we go. We got a tag team move. Uh-oh, what do they got going? Oh, nice. And a pin. He goes for the cover. One. Oh, the kick out of the one. The early pin. Not even close. Uh oh. Incredible strike. Nice. There may be no oh, and gets a tag to Akira Tozawa. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. His Suplex is on. Roaring elbow. This is a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. Oh, gets the running form. Plenty of force behind that elbow. Oh, what a reversal. Dragon screw leg whip from Kira Tozawa. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against right another now, duo. Right now, Kira Tozawa is in trouble. There's a special stipulation added to the match. The traditional rules of a singles match apply. All right, here we in go. In terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, count out. Another double team. Nice. Oh, hoo, 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 hoo. what a, a double DDT team. wheelbarrow suplex. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Bobby Michael. Fish in able to tag team match. One stop the oncoming attack. Oh, what a reversal. Standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor just in the ring trading as far as is concerned is the legal man. Only the legal man oh, can attempt wow. to fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In the tag match when the superstar tags their oh, partner, the person trading who reversals. Out has until the referees count five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, oh, what a brain buster from Hideo to the, the, the partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch, uh -oh. and the referee must see the tag be made. Oh, what a it's all drop. from here. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, wow. Uh oh. Oh, what a reversal. He's taking There's a takedown. At this point, it's all about how he responds and potentially rebounds. Oh. He has such a wide array of offense anywhere in the ring. Sunset flip. Oh, it's kick out after the win. To keep his shoulders down. Can you believe what he's withstood here tonight? Oh, went for the... Gotta think about using the finisher here pretty soon, I would think. Just pick up the win and move on. There's no need to keep this thing going longer than necessary. Oh, whips him to the corner. Oh, gets the, the face, taking some running face here. wash. Tag. And back in is Akira Tozawa. Getting the crowd revved up. Good Starting point by Byron on earlier. The There's an opening to execute the Bobby finish. Bobby Fish take it. The last thing you want to do desperately is needs to get a no tag to tell you bad things happen when you do that. Kyle you know, O'Reilly. Just go back and watch Skip versus Barry Horowitz from 1995. I remember. Oh look! Oh, oh what a oh, jumping, this man jumping kick! What a maneuver! Gonna go for the tag team finisher. Yep. Oh look! Bobby Fish get total in elimination. Here it is. Seems to be guys Bam. Like we're just clearly on a mission here. Can he finish the job? That might be it. Goes for the cover. He's got the shoulders down. And there it is. The pinball and the, the undisputed arrow, aka Red Dragon.
Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly pick up the victory over Team Japan. That was just one of those matches that the saw some great double team action there from Red Dragon. What a like jump and spin kick there from Bobby Fish. There's a whole elimination there. Oh uh, yeah, Red Dragon. Well, that one was over before it even started. It's performances like the one we just saw from these guys that makes tag team wrestling two. so exciting. I hope you set your DVR oh, because tag that team match wrestling is worth going so back special. and watching again. All righty. Still got a few more matches re remaining. Singles Next up, we got Mustafa Ali going up against the Scottish the Supernova, Noam Dar. The score. Um, this should be high-flying like crazy. And, uh, yeah, should be really good. So let's go ahead and go to the ring. All right, first up, Mustafa Ali. Making his way to the Dude ring. is quite the high From flyer. Chicago, and he's only getting more and more better and more and more loved by the fans. Mustafa, and Mustafa Ali, Ali definitely has an opportunity to make it really far in 205 line. And I do believe that someday he will become cruiserweight champion. Chicago police officer turned WWE superstar. Hey Byron, maybe you should wear it's one only of a matter of time. You never see my face or hear you. All right, here comes the Scottish Supernova, Noam Dar. The Scottish Supernova. And from Air Scotland, weighing in at 178 pounds, Noam Dar. My one word for the hour is smug. Noam Dar just recently. Uh, been in matches over at NXT UK. Um, recently had a had a match for the um, United Kingdom Championship against uh, Pete Dunne, and although he was not successful, still had an excellent match with the Bruiserweight. He's the first Israeli-born superstar to compete in WWE. He's got a, bit of, a little bit of his old swag going, too. He's smug. All right, let's do this. Mustafa Ali, Noam Dar. All right, call elbow, elbow tie up. Elbow tie up in a battle for control here. Nice. Okay. Oh. Oh, what a step up into Guri from pain here. Mustafa Ali. Oh, what a reversal. Oh, wow. Oh, what a backstabber. Breaker does its job. He's oh, got to cover. Got up quickly left. after that. This early, no chance. Oh, reverse no Rana. Way. Good God. Inverted Frankensteiner. Running four on. Oh, nice. Oh, I think this man needs business. Uh-oh, he's going to the top rope. What's he going to try here? 
Oh. There it is, the diving leg drop. It's a flying leg drop. Uh-oh, what's he going to try here? Running power bomb. And he lands, shoulders on the back. And some homage himself on there to uh, everyone to follow their dreams and be the best they Liger can be. Usually has all that, that running Liger bomb. notions and showing the power of ambition, fellas. I oh, exploder into the corner. Just then. And I remember and no this industry is about winning. Ali needs to worry more about that. I want to add to the discussion of Mustafa Ali as a. All right. Kick out. Kick That's out. either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Nobody controls the pace of a match oh. quite like this guy. Nice. There's no coming back from that. Springboard. Oh, springboard like, jump. Okay. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. And now. He's displaying classic offense here. Mustafa Ali, oh, with a, a handful of reversals. He's going for it all. Whoa. Oh, misses the leg drop again. But I don't think that hurt him too badly. Man, what a move. Unbelievable power. All righty. Is he going for that? That middle rope neck breaker. Oh, oh here it is. Oh, a what a play. reversal. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, and he hits a magnificent Hurricane Rana. Oh, boy, he is rolling from behind. He's just so dominant. To the outside, uh -oh. which will start the referee's count. Think he's going to go for it again? He, he just That's may go for it again. Oh, look at Andes. He's got to do it quick. Oh, oh man. Andes. Look at Andes. He's got to do it quick. I guess he's not close here, enough to it. But he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. He's doing exactly Maybe what he, he didn't want to do here. Maybe he will be now. He's letting his opponent right back into this match. There it is. Goes Next for the pin. Nice. Here's his moment, Michael. I think Mustafa Ali just secured this match. And there's the victory for Mustafa he got Ali. It. He got it. He Didn't even got have it. to do the 0-5-4. He's got that middle rope. These guys feel no love for each other. Breaker. Here's another look. Beautifully executed. Just, that was just all it took was right position. Apparently. A legendary performance. But Mustafa Ali wins pretty, that was a match pretty much in watch again impressive and again and again. fashion. From the opening bell, this match was one for the ages. I'm almost definitely speechless. one of his almost. coolest moves. But yeah, Mustafa Ali is your winner. Pretty convincing win. win. To start the show. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back wondering how in the world like I said, follow that. Future Cruiserweight champion someday. I believe it. Stay tuned for more. I mean, we got to wrestle for the Cruiserweight title at WrestleMania, so he's had the spotlight on him. All right, you guys. It's time for our main event of the evening. We've been waiting a long time for this one. The championship the is cruiserweight up championship right is up Next. for grabs we have a real as Drew Gulak, the champion, will defend against Grand Metallic of the Lucha House Party. Grand Metallic has a chance to become um, cruiserweight champion for the first time. Let's go to the ring for our main event. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. All right, first up, we got the challenger. You the Lucha House Party? Yeah, I am. Byron, you know why Metalik wears that mask? Oh, why, Corey? In Mexico, he owes a lot of people a lot of money. I find that hard to believe. Byron, you should try it on. Oh, 
Graham Metellix got his hands full. There's Drew Gulak. He's out for blood. Byron, you know why Graham Metellix has worn a mask since the day he was born? Uh, why is that? Cool? The doctor had to put it on to stop his mother from crying because he was so ugly. Stop. So Graham Metellix got to use his speed and high flying ability, and he's really got to take Drew Gulak seriously. All right, here's your cruiserweight champion, Drew Gulak, who's constantly fighting for a better 205 Live. The fact is, Drew Gulak is a skilled mat technician. He pays great attention to detail, especially when it means manipulating the human anatomy. You know he actually cornered me with his PowerPoint presentation explaining how he was gonna win here tonight? Alrighty. I think that's the first time I fell asleep. Let's see how this open. goes. Let's go to the ring for our introductions. That's what it's all about. Get ready for some WWE magic. All right, this is our main event for the cruiserweight title. Should be good. The challenger, Graham Metali, the champion, Drew Gulak. All right, they lock up. Finally, these two are in the ring where their grudge can get settled. No more excuses. We're going to find out who the better superstar is. Oh, if you and a cheap hit shot there. Yet, now might be a good time to do that. Oh, these guys are gonna have a match. You'll and right watch now, the champ is over again. Come out firing. Oh, oh what's he got here? Oh, he's inflicting <laughs> some serious pain here. What a stretch. He's going and for the just pin. like that right into and a pin. And mentally quickly kicks out. Not yet. Missed the drop kick and then takes a clubbing blow there. Oh, Saito suplex. Nice move. And the champ is is getting is getting angry. His shoulders are down. Oh, it's going to take more than that to keep his bridge, shoulders down. And the match continues. Count, barely that. Oh, misses the running forearm. Oh, reverse Rana from Anatalik. Now that's the type of move that sends a message to an opponent. We got a cover. The rankings are out, guys. Oh, and another this one count has under. to be happy about what the Bridging backdrop this week. And Grand Metalik quickly kicks out. Oh, and there's a power bomb. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. Showing, showing some of his power with his technical skills. Oh, the reversal by uh, Grand Metalik. Man, Ooh, look at the quickness of Gulak. Well, many are clearly happy with this week's power rankings, as Byron was saying. I can tell you, Drew Gulak, the champion, is standing tall right now. Today, you were none too pleased. Well, there's only one way to fix that, and that's to go out there and win. There's no use walking around with a boo-boo face. That'll get you oh. nowhere. Uh oh, the king of the ropes gonna hit the ropes? Yes, he is. Very nice. Very nicely executed. 
Every superstar now knows Graham that the Metallic key to being a perennial main pin. eventer is securing. Oh, the champion, champion kicks, kicks out rather Keep quick. Keep all your signs down. Gulak isn't yeah. out of this one yet. Uh, take he's more close. than that. Oh, Gulak with a close down line he to goes. The, that was impressive, Cole. His head. All right. The talents are not looking good right now. His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. Corey's absolutely right. Oh, Whoa, man. The Dropped him on his suplex. head. You don't see that very often. He's back in control here. Hooked him up. And there it is. Uh-oh. Oh, got the knees up as he went for the frog splash. With the knee now. But it didn't seem to phase him that much because he's back up. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very All shortly, right. guys. And when it's that happens, oh, you can bet arm this one's going to be over. And Grand Metalik slips out of harm's way. When this guy's on, look out. Nearly driven through the oh, map. Northern oh, Light Suplex. Through Gulak. Big move coming. I'm with Corey. I said, oh, I think this man means business. Just when you thought we were going right. to crown a new champion. Second time? Sure. Why not? Oh, but here comes Grandma Tully. The champ's starting to stumble a bit. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. This may very well be the opportunity. Oh, his opponent was looking spinning for clothesline. To turn this thing around. Unbelievable move by Gulak. Uh-oh. Going for the Gulak. Now. Hopefully Grandma. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Looking for an opening to that finisher, it seems. Wearing and that's down. a smart move. Just hit the finisher, get the win, and get out of there. When he released it that time. Uh-oh. What's the champ got going? Oh, nice. Gosh, I don't know if I've ever seen anyone utilize a splash like that. Anytime a superstar sees an opening for their finisher, they got to take it, as Byron was saying. Oh, Elongating the match not only gives your opponent an opportunity to get back in it, but you're also running the risk of injury anytime you're in the ring longer than so you have to. I'm going to go for another yeah, Gulak. Oh, oh, oh wow. Gulak. He sent it in rather quick. Unbelievable move by Gulak. This one's over, guys. Oh, man. And, and it looks, oh, and after the second this. attempt, Grandma Telik had no choice but to tap out. He had it locked up and made his opponent tap out. And... Drew Gulak is still your back with that amazing WWE Cruiserweight Champion. Grand Metallic fought hard as he could. Night long. One of the but Drew Gulak, WWE matches after the um, second Gulak, Gulak attempt, was enough to make him submit. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Ever. So, TLC, Drew Gulak will make highlight. his next title defense against else. Gentleman Jack Gallon. Here's your winner, and still the WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Drew Gulak. Kicking off Drew with Gulak. An impressive victory. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match will tells face me we're at Gentleman who will Jack Gallagher, and he's got to remember to take him seriously. Event. He may be a gentleman, but he's a gentleman that can tangle with any of the cruiserweights. But that will do it for this episode of 205 Live. Thank y'all for watching. This is Blitzball Champ on behalf of Geek Out with Gangs Out and Team Galgo Wrestling. We'll see you next time. Laters.